everyone, it's Shy. I hope you're all doing good today. So it's been a minute, um, but I really wanted to do a little comeback. Um, I've just been really busy. Um, I just finished a placement um, and you may or may not know because I've mentioned it a few times now, but I am a nursing student. So sometimes things get a little hectic, but right now I've just finished clinicals. So I have like a nice little month long break before going back. So I'm going to enjoy myself and play some sims. So today's video is going to be a current household. Um, I have this, <laughs> I've been, I played the perfect life challenge with my sim Jamie Hayes, who I will show you. So this is Jamie. His full name is Jamison. Um, but he, I call him Jamie. Um, so I started the perfect life challenge with him and, um, I just wanted to just have a sim who I played from the like, um, from like the ground up basically because normally I just make a young adult sim and then I just play them and that's it but I really wanted to play a sim who I had been playing for a while and just kind of establish everything because growing together was on its way out so I wanted to um just really you know focus on building up his like skills and his personality and everything and just get really attached to him which I have so I will show you his skills first of all so Jamie is adventurous he's active he's loyal he's an overachiever self-assured and he's a bro um I think some of these he's gotten through the feature where you can kind of add traits but yes um and then I've never seen this one before. Completing the neighborhood confidant aspiration. Huh? I, I've never seen that before. But anyway, apparently he has this. Um, he's apparently really good at gardening and fishing. Um, that's just a mod. Uh, star player because he was the captain of the football team. Um, he's got a strong presence in charisma, which is also a mod. He's physically gifted because he completed the rambunctious scamp. Um, aspiration um, he doesn't really like mischief he was a top-notch toddler because he got level 5 in all of his toddler skills um, he's responsible um, he doesn't like he's not very good at singing he'd be happy to have a child active employee because he's in the um, detective career and he graduated uni with honors so I've kind of really <laughs> gone through the whole process of him um, unfortunately we didn't have milestones when I played it so he doesn't really have a lot of milestones but you'll see here that he actually died um, <laughs> so he died of hunger this one time while he was at uni I don't know what happened but he literally went to sleep and then the next day like he was dead it was really bizarre I don't know if that was like a clash of mods or whatever but he basically died of starvation and then I used MC command to bring him back to life because I was like what the hell but anyway um yeah so he actually died but he survived he made a new um yes so he made a self-discovery which is his new trait which is active um he earned a psychology degree and he started his job as a detective um so he made best he's made some best friends he started a romantic relationship with his current wife who i will show you he fell in love with his current wife, he got engaged to her, and he recently got married to her. So, yeah. Is there anything else to show you guys for him? Not really. I mean, he's had some pretty terrible things happen. He's had a first woohoo, he's had a bladder failure, and he also passed out at some point. But anyway, I don't know why that needs to be commemorated, but there you go. Anyways, and then... um. He has this dog, Butter, who I recently just got. And this dog is by Pug Owned on the gallery. So check them out if you don't know about them or haven't seen them already. So currently their house is a little bit of a work in progress. Um, so this is their backyard. There's not much going on as of yet, just because it's a work in progress. You know, they're young. They've recently moved here. So this is their house um i built it 
um, when we first found out about Growing Together coming out because I thought this was a very San Francisco style esque home. Um, San Sequoia is not exactly how I pictured it, but I feel like the house fits here um, and the color as well. So I kept it and this is the house that they currently live in. Um, so yeah, so they do live in San Sequoia, which um, I'm sure you can recognize. And I did use the tool mod to just add a few more interesting things like in and around the walkway area here. So I've got some benches here that I added, some of these food stands and like the bus from the wolf pack um and i added more things here as well so sometimes for some reason there's only this vendor and i think it's because of a mod that i have that basically stops random generation of townies so i need to add more townies basically so that these can be opened um because he's the only one <laughs> yeah so he's the only one this guy here J jason crane is the only vendor that ever operates any of these stalls so i need to add more um townies so that these can be opened but sometimes this one's open sometimes that one's open and you know um, but aside from that, I haven't really added much. I'm actually thinking to check out the Ultimate Save by Plumbob Kingdom. Um, I actually have it downloaded already. But yeah, I added a little like children's park thing here in the middle. Um, so yeah, so some of the kids come over and they play. So we've got a little kid here playing. Um, but yeah, and so that's Jamie. And then I will show you his wife. This is Bethany. Um, she is an absolute cutie so I kind of played her as well in her teenage years um, so she's a bro she's outgoing she's self-assured she's a foodie and she's warm-hearted um, this is a mod um, and she was a cheerleader <laughs> I know um, how cliche but she was a cheerleader um, she's good at logic um, she was a happy toddler um, she's good at charisma not very good at programming she's a mediator um she's socially gifted um she's not apparently not very good at cooking but she does all the cooking in the house so yeah i don't know about that um she is really good at singing and she's neutral to having kids and um i don't know where she got this from but apparently this is a reward store trait which makes it harder for um relationships to decay for her she um, completed the drama llama aspiration so she's got the untroubled and she's domestic and graduated with honors as well and she got a degree in biology um yeah so she's got a few things going on here so um yeah so she's got made a best friend got engaged fell in love got married and widowed and i will tell you about that but yeah basically jamie died again but yeah we won't talk about that <laughs> uh, no i'm just joking i'll tell you about it um in a minute but basically yeah so these are all her traits um yeah so anyways let me give you a quick tour of the house so again i built this and i did ucc um because I love CC so I am a self-professed CC addict so naturally I do use a lot uh, yeah so th this is just their like living area so we've got like a desk area here um, um, some clothes hanging um, just to make it look a bit more lived in uh, just a little dining area here very simple because as I said they've like recently moved in they've just like finished college and have started their careers and stuff so you know they aren't like absolutely like rich as you can see they only have six grand and they're still paying off their university loans so we've got some ways to go with that um, yeah, and then this is the kitchen. I actually really like how this turned out. I don't usually use like dark colors, but I thought it, um, it looked really nice. And this is just their little laundry area. Um, and then they have a bathroom here, which isn't very like any very special, but basically this bathtub shower combination, this is my life now. Like I want to use it in every house like literally but anyway yeah nothing exciting it's literally just a bathroom 
I'm not very good at doing bathrooms. And then this is their bedroom, which is definitely my favorite room in the whole house. But yeah, um, very, very pretty. I haven't added much yet. So they just have like a dog bed for butter. And this wall is completely blank and there's nothing here as of yet. Just because, as I said, you know, it's not like they're rich. So I didn't want to waste money on buying any more clutter. And I've just got a little vanity here, which Bethany uses sometimes. And yeah, so that's pretty much their house. Um, as you can see right now, they've got a bunch of empty rooms. I was hoping to have them have some children, um, which was the whole point of playing Jamie because I wanted to um, like just progress and start growing together but then I got busy and I never actually got to play with an infant so I've not played with infants this whole entire time I know absolutely crazy isn't it I've not had a single infant in my game so I'm hoping to have one with them but I did have some pretty bad news yesterday it's not in her um, moodlets anymore but basically Bethany went to the doctor and she was told that she has like um issues with her fertility basically so trying for a baby is going to be hard but i will show you when she does this fertility test that i just told her to go do um it says she has zero percent chance of becoming pregnant so this is um this is all with a mod but basically i think that they're gonna have some issues conceiving so we will have to see what happens when we follow along with the rest of this current household but yeah so we shall see what happens i might have them adopt i might have them try the surrogacy route um but we'll have to see anyways so bethany is a registered nurse um and she just recently got promoted to level four. So she's now an actual registered nurse. She was like an intern kind of thing before. Um, so she now works in the ER and stuff like that. So she's got this really cute um, outfit, which <laughs> um, comes with, what pack is it? Uh, Get Together. Um, so she's got her cute little nurse outfit on where she's just got some scrubs and she looks absolutely adorable and now that she's not like looking down I will show you her up close because Bethany is absolutely gorgeous so yeah and then um, Jamie is a sergeant in the police um, he's in the detective career um, and he is an absolute cutie patootie this is him he's cute um yeah so in his relationships um he's got his dad who is andrew and his mom samantha and um these are like his in-laws who he doesn't have very good relationship with and just some like a few friends he's met at uni and stuff basically if you're wondering why his relationships are like very little for how long I've played him it's because I did move him into a new safe file and he lost all his like childhood friends and all the rest of that um but I just wanted them to be in a like a nicer safe file because I was fine when you play sims in the same safe file for ages they just yeah it just gets messy after a while so I did move him into a new save file um so yeah anyways so I'll play them for a little bit and you can kind of just get to see them so our dog is kind of in heat right now so let's um let's see what we can do about that for him um hmm Let's see what we can do for you. Encourage to mate with George. <laughs> Let's encourage Butter to go mate with George. Um, so I think Butter's a girl, but yeah. Let's encourage her to go mate with George. She's a beautiful golden retriever, which is like, I would love to have a golden retriever dog in real life. So off she goes, she cannot wait to go. <laughs> She's like, I'm going. Um, I don't know if we'll keep the puppies if she does have puppies but I just figure you know she's in the mood so let her so he's just gonna go and he's gonna fill the bowl it is harvest fest but they've already kind of had their harvest fest dinner 
Um, so I'm going to have him clean up the plates from that. And Bethany up here, I'm going to have her change her outfit back into this. So this is one of my absolute favorite outfits that came with um, going together. Oh, don't know why I did that. Um, one of my absolute favorite outfits that came with growing together. I just love this combo. I think it's just so nice and especially these two colors and they're very much her colors. As you can see, the house is like yellow and oranges and stuff. So it's definitely her vibe. Um, so it's Harvest Fest. Let's see what their needs are looking like. I mean, they're pretty good. They're pretty chill. So currently at the moment, I am relentlessly getting them to try for pregnancy. Um, and we'll just see how that goes. So she's going to go over here. She's going to be like, do you want to try for a baby again? Even though her fertility <laughs> chance is zero. Um, but yeah, so um, I will show you some pictures of like Jamie's life in the meantime. Um, so just so you can see like what he was getting up to when he was a teenager and stuff um so i'll show you in just one second yeah so this is jamie when he was a little boy um so the um he was just the cutest toddler ever um and these are him and his parents um i built him a preschool because i'm extra like that and so he met some other toddlers and he became friends with them and it was just really cute and fun. Then he became besties with somebody. Um, he got an allowance, so he started receiving an allowance. So I do post my Sims on Tumblr, so I do have a lot of pictures. I'm like obsessed with taking pictures of my Sims. I have no idea what this face is about. Um, but he made another bestie over here and another one. He's really outgoing and he gets on really well with people. So now we're into his teenage years. It was his birthday here, I think. Yeah. And he is, isn't he just so cute? He's my baby. I love him. Um, he was having a little breakout here. So, you know, he was feeling a bit embarrassed as it was his first day of school. Um, as you can see here, he's got that first day of school selfie going on. Um, then he joined the football team so um, this is him practicing with one of his friends um, this is when he were first met Bethany and they were having like a bro hug she's also a bro um, and then like a cute little kiss and also this adorable little moment here get you a girl that looks at you the way Bethany looks at Jamie and then there was a little drama going on so there was another girl as well she's absolutely gorgeous as well so Jamie had three crushes in high school but in the end he ended up picking Bethany just because they vibed better they got on really well and yeah so he asked her to prom he even made her a cute little sign and everything they attended do you know those events um the ones that happen on Thursdays and Fridays they attended quite a lot of those together took a lot of selfies and just they spent so much time together that it was just natural for the friendship to like progress and they went to prom together um yeah and then Jamie started college so this is him they're on a cute little date um <laughs> Bethany has some of the funniest facial expressions I'm obsessed with her um yeah then they like graduated high school in the middle of them like starting college um just some cute little dates between them here and at some point Jamie did propose it was right towards the end of their time at college I love this and I just love this cute little face here so adorable um and then they moved in together um and I took some cute little pictures of them in front of the house and that's pretty much it for that little cute photo session anyways back to these two so they did just finish trying for a baby I don't know why the music is still going off um, and as I said their needs are like pretty good right now so what I might have them do is actually go for a day I might have them just go like bowling or something just um, you know just for funsies it's only like 6 p.m. although it's like midweek but 
I don't think Jamie's working and um and um Bethany has like other things going on so I think we'll check out this restaurant or should we go to the no let's check out this restaurant no actually I don't want them to go to a restaurant Let's have them go bowling. I want them to go bowling. I hope they put some clothes on when they go bowling. Yeah, okay, good. They put some clothes on, so that's good. So we're just gonna have them come over here. So this is a, the sound is really loud. So I'm actually just gonna turn that down a little bit. Um, put that to like 23. Um, yeah, so this is a lot, another lot that I, I did build. It's one of my favorite builds that I've ever done, to be honest. But, um, yeah, so it's kind of like a cinema slash bowling alley slash restaurant. Um, cause I really like multi-purpose lots. So when I build them, I almost always go for a multi-purpose lot. So we're not going to bother having them come over here and get a table or any of that. I'm literally just going to have them come up here and they're going to, um, go bowling I'm gonna play a 10 frame game with Jamie so here we come it's only like as I said it's really early although Bethany's quite tired not sure why oh yeah um <laughs> Jamie got the moodlet um trying for a baby Jameson would love to have a child and is hyped to be trying for a pregnancy so yeah he's like super excited to be trying um bethany also has got the same mood lit um so we'll see what happens because she hasn't actually told jamie yet about the whole fertility thing um so we'll see because currently at the moment they haven't had any conversations about what they're gonna do if they can't have babies um yeah I love the way Sims bowl. It's so funny. Um, I especially love it when they like slip on the floor and they fall. Ugh, look at these horrible bowling shoes. Ugh, I hate wearing bowling shoes. It's the worst. It's just a thought that someone else was wearing those shoes before you. It just makes me feel so uncomfortable. <laughs> yes, Jamie. Woo! Yeah, it's that athletic skill. Yes, Jamie bowling skill acquired okay come on then bethany show us what you got jamie did a little bit of a flare just now let's see what you got for us girl come on that's it Woo! oh okay no she hit like one pin amazing <laughs> okay <laughs> clearly she's not very good at bowling jamie let's see what you got come on what have you got for us? Come on then. Oh, that's embarrassing. That's definitely happened to me before while I was bowling. <laughs> bowling has just like this really unique way of making people look really stupid. Oh, see, we've got a student loan due. Um, so we'll pay that. Um, and I feel like paying 200 today. So we're gonna pay that. <sighs> okay. That was really bad. So he started off with a really, you know, f dramatic flair and then went on to do these embarrassing moves. It's not going very well for you guys, is it? Not very good bowlers. I'm gonna have to have them come bowling more often. Oh, yes, Bethany, that was really good. That was almost a strike. Yeah, she's feeling a bit nauseous. She's got some PMS symptoms, which sucks, but it is what it is. And Jamie is feeling enamored from somebody nearby, so that's great. Is that? Oh, I thought she was nauseous because she was pregnant, but yeah. She... Jamie? Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Look at him feeling himself. He's so extra. All my days. So extra. Come on then, Bethany. 
Let's see if you can make Jamie regret doing that cocky little dance that he just did. Come on. Um, yeah. Strike! Yes! Except, you see, she's not extra like him, so she doesn't have to do a little cocky dance to make him feel some type of way. She is a very not extra girl. She's just like, yeah. I've got a strike, pretty cool, relax. Jamie's very competitive and very extra, that's the thing. <laughs> um, we're not going to use Social Bunny. They, neither of them have used Social Bunny since they were like in high school. So that's just not really their vibe anymore. Who are these Sims? Let's have a look. Tanya Burke, she's cute. We've got Bradley Brunner. Okay. Uh, that was really bad. I'm pretty sure her ball landed here. And that was it. <laughs> that was embarrassing, Bethany. Okay. Let's get it. Uh, girl, I mean, you literally almost got a strike. Why are you mad? I guess because she knows Jamie's going to mock her. Oh, not as good as Bethany. No, no. Sorry, I am just gonna, yeah. Because I want to see. Bethany's actually not doing too bad, you know. She's getting better for sure. Um, Let's see what happens. Come on, guys. There's too much of a like weird weight in between the games. I don't know. Might have to look at that in the um in the configuration settings. Wow! Yes, Jamie, a strike. Woo! I feel like Bethany's gonna win. What's your bets? Place them now. I feel like Bethany's gonna win. Okay, it's getting really late. <laughs> I feel like we shouldn't have done a 10 frame game. <gasps> okay, um, never seen that before. I've not really used, <laughs> I don't really play the bowling pack very often. Never seen that move before. Okay, Jamie, extra. See, I told you he's super extra. Um, how much longer till this game is done? yes get it girl get it girl yeah she was like you thought you were the only one yeah come on so when are they gonna finish this game this 10 frame game is taking ages i wish i hadn't chosen it now because it's getting late does jamie have work yeah he has work tomorrow um bethany doesn't though so let's see. Ah, so while they bowl, I'll tell you about how Jamie died again. Because Jamie just literally just likes dying. I don't know why. But basically, um, they went <laughs> from bowling. She's got an uh, uncomfortable moodlet from bowling too much because her muscles are aching. Yeah, that's what you get for doing all those crazy moves. Um, anyway... Um, so they went on a honeymoon to Solani. It was really nice, lovely. And they were there for like a day and Jamie was hungry. Um, and I was literally, Bethany was in the middle of cooking and then he died of starvation. I know, absolutely annoying as hell. Um, so Bethany came over, begged the Grim Reaper and the Grim Reaper said no because he's rude. And then... Um, naturally jamie died and that is how bethany became a widow so annoyingly they're actually not married right now because i did revive him um so i have to get them married again but they had just got married so in my mind they are husband and wife and honestly i'll probably forget to get them married again 
because yeah Bethany's surname is changed and everything now um she used to be Bethany Garcia but she's now Bethany Hayes um ah finally Jameson won the bowling game with a score of 138 ah I thought Bethany was gonna win <laughs> well anyways um let me know if you thought Jamie or Bethany was gonna win and yeah um so I'm actually gonna stop the video there I am gonna send them both home but I am gonna stop the video there I hope you enjoyed a little cheeky glimpse into my um my current household um actually I'll show you how cute Bethany looks in her um autumn gear she looks super cute and yeah so they are on their way home now so as I said I hope you guys enjoyed that little glimpse into my current household and I will see you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching and please like comment and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time bye <music>